the Alzheimer's supplement you're not taking but might want to consider? Maybe. Here's a brand new study came out in 2025, creatine monohydrate pilot in Alzheimer's feasibility, brain creatine and cognition. And while this is not a placebo controlled trial, the results of this study are pretty impressive. 20 people, they all have Alzheimer's disease. They give them 20 grams of creatine per day for eight weeks. In other words, they give them 10 grams of creatine powder twice a day. They take the creatine, they mix it in any liquid they want. So I made some notes and here's what happened. And by the way, all these results are statistically significant. No surprise, there was about 11% improvement in the creatine content in their brains. Again, that's to be expected since they were taking creatine supplements, but here's where things get interesting. There was about a 4.4% improvement in what's called global thinking ability. Their overall cognition scores improved by about 4% and it gets better still. There was about a 7% improvement in what's called mental flexibility. In other words, their ability to solve problems improved by 7% and it gets better still. There was about a 12% improvement in short-term memory and their ability to read also improved by about 5%. Keep in mind, this is not a placebo controlled trial. It has to be followed up by larger clinical trials. And there was no quality of life test done. In other words, did these results result in a better quality of life of these people? That was not done either. Nonetheless, this study only lasted eight weeks and still produced some pretty interesting results.